Gaan ze wel een goal halen, Hey, good morning everybody. Welcome to a new vlog. Um, what's going on today? I definitely know that I'm not gonna film a whole vlog in just one day. Because uh, there's so much snow outside, I need to plan a little bit. I have a lot going on today. And I especially need to change my tires today. That's really important because there's so much snow outside. And if I have an accident, it's just gonna be super, super expensive. All right, I would say let's get the day started. <laughs> I'm finally done. It's so annoying. Like, Switzerland has a special law for stuff like this. If I have an accident, it's gonna be really f***ing expensive. And now, I'm gonna go to the shop opening of my friends. I think it's a snowboard surf shop or something. I don't know what the heck is going on, but my car is making some weird sounds. Let's see if you can hear it. It's like vibrating. I don't know, it's just because they're new or something. I'm driving them for like the second time. So right here it is, my friend's new shop. It's called JK, JNK, or Avagiotte und K. There's no link in bio. You gotta be here. Bernstrasse 202, 102, uh, Luzern. Lu Luzern. How, how the heck do I say that in f***ing English? <laughs> if you leave, I would fall. Are you holding on to my life? Yeah, I've just been here for a couple hours and it's actually just an outlet store because they're about to start like a furniture store for Balinese furnitures. I think it's a really, really good idea. It's like um, surf shops, skate shops and stuff like this. It just like, I feel like it doesn't work anymore like this. Like. A lot of people buy their stuff online and not in shops anymore. That's why I said I really have to get used to driving Switzerland again. Yeah, <laughs> it's so weird. I'm really used to driving America now. I also completely forgot to tell you that it's just an outlet store with just O'Neill stuff, but you have 40% off. It's probably not really the season to buy O'Neill stuff, but anyway, 40% off. I think it's pretty cool. Go check it out. Link not in bio, Bernstrasse 102. It's so weird. Welcome to a new vlog. Today I'm selling my old Canon ADD flashback when I was in Australia. As you can see, I'm on a different camera. That has a reason. Because something really bad and dumb happened. That was a really expensive drone shot. I, st I stopped our car to make a drone shot. camera there to film something yeah when I drove away I forgot my camera it's really bad because we had an amazing day yesterday we went ocean rafting we went to the Whitsunday Islands and to the White Heaven Beach it was really amazing It. I have to buy a new camera, I guess. It's really, really dumb, and we drove all the way back. I'm really sorry, Anya, it was my fault. <laughs> Dang it! What else can I say? Oh, yeah, and we lost around uh, two hours now because we drove all the way back to get back to that place where I lost my camera. Yes, my mom just told me that my ADD is ready uh, to send back to Fiji. I just took a photo, and it's so freaking cold. So, the mission for today is I gotta find a spot to skate. I want to show you guys like how to find a spot in the winter to skate somewhere outside. Yeah, let's let's do that. It's been outside for 10 minutes and my it's already full of ice. It's minus four degrees. I gotta get that ice away though. <laughs> yeah, guys, I have a huge problem. <laughs> I'm not sure if I'm able today to show you around. Like, I really have a problem with that. F my car is not even. F working I just want you to work you know I wasn't driving that car for four months so I shouldn't even stop it right now you know I haven't experienced snow in Switzerland for like the last two years like two years ago I was injured I broke my foot so I wasn't really able to go outside and stuff and last year I was in America oh it's working now actually it's good to get used to the snow so like I would just like 
you know, see how my car reacts and stuff. Yeah, I just stopped my car because like it's wet, it has snow on the street, I shouldn't film and drive and do all that dangerous stuff. If you're living in a village and you want to go skate, it's super hard to find a spot, I know about that. Well, you have to check out the factory side and like check out like some, some bigger places, maybe some shopping places or stuff like this. Well, I was always heading to the city. So Switzerland is super close together everything so when I was heading to the city I needed like 20 minutes or 30 minutes or something and in the city you have a lot more stuff to skate in the winter and I'm gonna show you around real quick today. So yeah, there's no indoor skate park or anything here in Lucerne. So I would pretty much like drive for 30 minutes to skate this spot. Back then I was super afraid of like falling down on the other side. I don't think it's a problem anymore and it's it's still waxed up somehow. Well, the problem here is people are working here, especially right now. So they will kick you out of here after like 30 minutes. It's not really a problem if you don't have a car, but like right now, I will park my car over there and they will pretty much know who you are so that's a big problem <laughs> just saying but I'm gonna do a no slide anyway fuck it guess what they just kicked me out of here I didn't even start to skate they're just like yeah no filming here and I'm like can I skate no 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 Switzerland I hate it for it they really don't like skateboarding here <laughs> or they also don't know what it is maybe I don't know what the heck yeah well everything changed a little bit since I left so that part is new as well I just discovered a new spot it's not too bad here I need to say but a lot of people will definitely get kicked out of here as well well anyway you definitely get tired of like getting kicked out of everywhere uh, this is really dirty now yeah so I bought my own skate parks with my friends or like we rented a place I just got kicked out of my own place I can't believe it um yeah I really wanted to make a video on how to skate in the winter so I guess I'm gonna go back to the other spot where I need to deal with the cold because down there it would have been like super warm um, I guess I just got here at the wrong time didn't expect that oh my god I thought like I would be able to even bring like a I don't know like to bring a little latch or something that would have been like my idea yeah I don't think there's a chance I'm gonna get a coffee I don't know man I'm just disappointed I'm, I'm not gonna lie I didn't expect it to be that bad that wet and like uh... <laughs> let's just do it let's do something I just want to do at least a couple flips I didn't skate for the last four days I gotta do something now I didn't have to deal with stuff like this for a while, my board's wet already and I'm like super cold to skate right now and I'm also like kinda... I didn't skate for a while so I'm not used to it anymore but like I just kinda have to get up motivated somehow alone. Uh... Well, I'm not gonna lie, it's really pretty f***ing hard to skate in the winter. It's cold, like especially my bushings, they get super cold and it gets like harder to turn around and stuff. But yeah, <laughs> I gotta do it, I just wanna skate right now. I really don't care if it's like that cold. But yeah, it makes things not easier. Um, but yeah, I think during the week I'll go to a couple skate parks, indoor skate parks. We'll see, we'll see. It's freezing out that way too cold to skate. I'm back home and now let's go for the Q&A. A lot of people give me good ideas for like what I should do here in Switzerland. I'm definitely gonna go to a couple mountains, gonna show you around, gonna do awesome drone shots on mountains even though I destroyed my Mavic Pro. <laughs> still have the spark the small drone the Mavic Pro works a lot better for me it doesn't matter I can still do some stuff like this 
I'm also I'm also thinking about like off-road wheels on on electric skateboards and stuff like this. I also got a snow skate and I have a snowboard, so I can do a lot of different stuff. Happy me is asking, do you miss San Francisco already? I do. I have to admit, when I got back, I was like, oh my god, I definitely underestimated the cold here in Switzerland. Uh, yeah, I also don't know where to skate anymore. My skate, you just, just saw the video. I also miss all the YouTubers and everyone I met over there. It was just an awesome community, especially to make videos. My last video is really not doing well, even though it's something like every skateboarder could use. Maybe the tile was bad? I don't know. Philip Macy is saying, do a house tour. It's my parents' apartment. I just, I can't do that. There are so many questions about my new e-board. I really don't know what, what I should say at this moment, but as soon as my website and everything is online, I will tell whatever I want about this board. But right now, it's just like, all I can say is it's not gonna be more expensive than $500. I say it's worth the wait. Because I think there's nothing else like this on the market right now. And I know what I'm talking about. Uh, yeah, it's, uh, that was weird. My new merch, by the way, is working super good. Get your own hoodie at fabianderik.ch. If you got your hoodie on shirts already, go tag me on Instagram at ha hashtag fabianderik. And I will share every post on Instagram. All right, that's pretty much it. I hope you enjoyed and we'll see each other tomorrow. Wait, not probably not tomorrow. I, I'm a little out of schedule right now and I need a little longer for my videos because I can't really... So forget, forget about it. How the heck do I end my vlog now? See you, bye bye.